if for example I want to to change the font okay just have to click the font that I want to change okay then I select it Okay, now the text that I've selected is the only text that I can change. Okay, now for example, let's say I want, okay, let me go back. For example, I want to create a paragraph here. Okay, and I want to create another paragraph. Mm, well, here. Okay. Now, once you click, okay. If you, once you click, and you could drag, click and drag, okay, or you can click on Shift, then just move the down arrow going down okay because you're selecting everything everything will get selected all right now whatever you select you could change it okay let's say we want a completely different font over here as you can see it's written calibre once you click on the arrow just next to calibre it brings down a drop down menu from this drop down menu you could, for example, select Comic Sans, or you could select any other text, okay? Any other font, rather, that you you choose to use, okay? So I've chosen to use Comic Sans, and my text has now changed, okay? The font of my text has now changed to Comic Sans, okay? Now, suppose I'm not happy with the font size at the moment my font size is 11 but i could decide to up it to 12 or even 13 okay although 13 will be too big so i've upped it okay i've increased its size to 12 all right however only the part that was highlighted has undergone that increment the rest of the document is still as it was all right now suppose i want to change the second paragraph as well all i have to do is to simply highlight the second paragraph and go through the same process okay i select comic sans all right and i change to 12 point size okay okay so basically, as you can see, LibreOffice works just the same as any other professional office productivity word processor, okay?